Hello everyone and welcome back to my cooking channel. Today I will show you how to properly make a classic savory delicacy. Feta cheese fry bread. The fluffiest homemade dough filled with tangy feta and fried until perfectly golden. Serve with honey to enhance its flavor even more. Let's begin. I have my hook attachment on my mixer and I will start with my dough. First, we have to mix our yeast with the water. The water, please, at room temperature because it will help the procedure. And now, mixy mix everything together. And the secret ingredient to make crispy and fluffy breads is Mr. What is that, Lucky's? Sesame oil. Okay. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> Galis? Exactly. This is the classic ingredient we're using in Greece to make all the kind of breads more crispy and more golden and more sexy. Now, I will add my flour, pinch of salt, all-purpose flour, but if you have a strong flour, it's okay to use it, and some olive oil, two tablespoons, the recipe is at akispetrezikis.com, my website. Exactly the ingredients, because you have to use exactly the amount of water and the flour to have a nice dough. If the water is more, then the dough will be runny. If the water is not enough, then it will be very uh, difficult to, to prepare it. Now, mix and mix everything together for at least five to eight minutes until the dough come together and it's ready to roll out, right? Yeah. Now. Back again in five minutes. And my dough is ready. As you can see, the dough is solid, nice, sexy. Something good is going to happen and it's called Tiranopsomo, okay? Now, this is a, a lovely dough. What is the ingredient inside the dough that is very important? Yeast, exactly. Now, I want to leave this lovely dough to rise until it doubles in size. So I will add a little bit of olive oil. I will add my dough here. And I want my dough to become... Okay, this is over, o overproof. But uh, anyway, we want to double in size, okay? Now, I will leave that on the side because I want to make some more tiganopsoma. And... I will carry on with the red one, this one. Now, this is something amazing. Now, it's a little bit sticky. If you see that the dough is sticky, you can use flour or olive oil. Depends what you want. I will use some olive oil. So it's not sticky anymore, as you can see. Okay, olive oil helps. Now, I want to divide my dough into 10 pieces. So, this is five. And this is five, so I want five pieces also. One, two, four, five. I will take one here, and I will start preheating my pan. Yeah, I have a non-stick pan here, and I will use again a little bit of olive oil, or flour, whatever you want. And as you can see, now I will roll out my dough like this. I will take some feta cheese. I will put in the middle. And maybe, not maybe, and, Katarina, can you help me? Because my, my hands are quite dirty, and I don't want to be dirty. Please, I'm out some oregano. This is an Olympus oregano. And maybe a little bit more, thank you. Cheers. And now I will fold it like this like an envelope, and I will press it. You can do that with a rolling pin or with your hands. Now it's time to prepare the first one. A little bit of olive oil to the pan, and we want to cook it through, so please do not have your heat in the higher, so don't have high heat, because you will cook them as pancakes, same way. And again, I have my dough here, a little bit of feta cheese. Feta cheese is the 
white gold of Greece. Roll it, flip it, fold it, press it, and cook it. Is it easy? Oh my God. So, I will carry on until I finish all my Tiganopsoma. It will not take more than five minutes. Oh, I have to flip them over. This one is ready, the other one is not ready yet. And when I finish, I will show you exactly what I did. And my fry breads are ready. Lovely. And if the Indians have uh, flatbreads, we have fry breads. Tiganopsuma. How you serve these lovely breads? Easy, cheesy, with some honey. This is something so Greek, so tasty, and so nice. And probably if you never serve those fry breads for a starter, you don't know what you are losing because everybody will start asking you where did you find this lovely recipe? And the answer will be to akispetridzikis.com or to akispetridzikis YouTube channel because it's the best Greek channel ever. This is exactly what you are going to say. Oh my God, this is lovely, heavenly, good and amazing. This is Greek honey, tasty. And of course, some sesame seeds on top. And of course, don't forget to make comments underneath the video and share this lovely recipe with your friends. Don't forget to download our website and don't forget to follow on social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok and Viber. Till next time, bye bye guys, gyasas, and I have to show you how those fry breads looks on the inside. Look at this. Feta cheese, oregano and honey. Mm. This, guys, is something that I cannot describe. It's the ultimate flatbread. I know that they are fry breads, but, but actually it's something so unique, so amazing. This is exactly the taste of grease in your mouth. See you guys. Oh my God.